Hey guys, so yesterday we decided to put up our Christmas tree. So I took a little time lapse of us putting it up. I think the camera cut out like halfway through. So I'll just input here what I have. <laughs> We're documenting Porter's last time in the bouncer. I'm gonna put it away. He's very upset, he hates it. He is 14 months old. It's December, no, it's November 21st. This is his last time. He will not miss it. You say bye bye, bye bye, bouncer. decision I wanted to get it up because I just feel like we're gonna be really busy Thanksgiving weekend and so I just wanted to get up now while we were not doing anything thankfully my sister also was over and so she helped me put the tree up because this year was very hard with two kids um, Porter just wanted to take everything down we broke an ornament gray wanted to put all the ornaments up himself and not have any help so it was really hard but here is the finished product here is our tree. Do you love it? Yes. Yeah, so we just went with the fake tree this year and not the real tree. Yeah, it's, so it's a little small. I'd like to get a bigger tree. This is just a six foot tree. We could go to seven or even eight foot and it would be much better. But for now, this is what we're doing. We've had this tree for like six or seven years, ever since we were in college. This is like the first fake tree I've ever gotten. Gray, don't touch the tree. You're gonna make it fall over, honey. So we'll see how long our tree stays up with two little kids, you know. Okay, sorry, Gray was like moving the tree. Oh my goodness. So anyway, that is our Christmas tree. Now our house is totally ready for Christmas and Santa. Grayson woke up this morning and the first thing he wanted to do was turn on the Christmas tree lights. And he made me take this really cute picture of him. I'll input that here. He went and got the Santa and the snowman and put it in between him and said cheese and had me take his picture. He's so cute. Porter's yeah. just not sure what to think about all this Christmas stuff, huh? Porter, what does Santa say? <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Yeah, this is what Gray did last, this morning. I'm take a picture. Oh, should I take a picture? Okay, say cheese. Oh, so cute. So anyway, that's what we did yesterday. Um, 
I was super chaotic, like I said, so I didn't really film that much. I just got a time lapse of us putting it up. This starts Thanksgiving week, and so it's gonna be lots of food and fun and some shopping. I'm so excited to go Black Friday shopping. But Gray has only one day of preschool this week, um, since uh, usually he would go on a Thursday, but Thanksgiving is on Thursday, so we are, he's not going. Gray is going to destroy this poor snowman. He is twirling it around by its hand. Uh, we used to have a different snowman and Gray broke that one. So this is the new snowman and I don't know how long it's going to last. Are you getting dizzy? Yeah. Meanwhile, Porter's in the corner here going through my diaper bag trying to find a snack. All he does is eat. And yeah, we're just kind of hanging out. Last night, the Charlie Brown Thanksgiving special was on, and so I recorded it, and I'm gonna play it for the boys and see what they think. I did this with the um, Halloween version, and halfway through, mind you, it's only a 30 minute episode, halfway through, Grayson turned to me and said, can we watch something different? <laughs> so I don't have high hopes that they're really gonna care for the Thanksgiving episode but why not watch it and get in the thanksgiving mood i guess there's not very many like thanksgiving movies i heard on the radio that like the only real thanksgiving movies is like planes trains and automobiles which i don't even think i've seen that movie so there's really no good thanksgiving movies so we're just gonna try to get into the thanksgiving spirit i'm gonna try to clean up this mess that Porter just made by tearing everything out. What are you doing? You trying to plug in the house? Is that a house? Ho, ho, ho. Santa. Okay, Gray, do you want to watch the Thanksgiving show? Yes. Yeah? I will update you guys after hopefully we get through it and let you know what they think of it. Okay, so we just finished Charlie Brown. What did you think of it, Gray? Did, it like it? did you like it? He watched it the whole time. Porter got disinterested in it, but he watched it the whole time and he never asked me to change it. So, Thanksgiving, good. Halloween, bad. Did you like it? Yeah? Okay. So, I'm here making dinner. I feel like deja vu, like this always happens while I'm making dinner. And I look over and I see Porter and this is what I see. He took Grayson's plate that was full from lunch because Gray did not touch it because how dare I make him noodles that was sitting right up here on the table and spilled it. That's the plate all on the floor. All the noodles and the grapes. And Porter's just helping himself. Every time this happens, I swear he makes such a mess but he's eating it and he's happy, so I'm just gonna leave it there while I make dinner and I'll clean it up once he's not happy. Oh my gosh, this is just my life with two kids. I have one kid happy watching the TV, but of course Porter doesn't care. Also, Porter is pretty much walking, like I said earlier. I just got this Snapchat video, I'll input that here. He is like walking and cruising. He does crawl sometimes and he does fall down a lot, but he just gets right back up and um, and just walks. So he is like a walker now, which is so sad because now that means I have a toddler and 
not a baby, and that makes me really sad. I told Anthony it's just time for another one because we don't have a baby anymore. <laughs> but yeah, he's getting big. He's walking now. So now I have two walkers and life's gonna get a little crazy because Porter's a lot more mobile now. Read it to Porter. Can you read the book to Porter? Yes, good. Read it to Porter. He yes, wants you to read it to him. This is Porter's favorite book, Animal ABCs. Can you read it, Grayson? No. Well, he started out reading and then he stopped. Grayson, those shoes are too small for you, honey. Those are too small. Yeah, they're too small. What is that, Porter? Those are too big. Is that big. a bear? Those are too right. big. They're too small. Your feet are too big. Those are for Porter now. It's a Porter. Porter is basically walking now. It's very exciting. Go, Porter. Go Porter, go Porter. No, you cannot lock us in here. How do you spell yes? Do you got a letter too? Oh, ah, ah, oh. What did you spell, Gray? Yes. Yes, Y-E-S spells yes. Can you spell go? O spells. <laughs>